telephone poles were on fire, trees were on fire. It was pretty uh, impressive, the, the amount of devastation. So she could have been with her mom this year and separated during the fire, or she could have just started being out on her own. Her paws were extremely burnt. We decided that she wasn't gonna make it on her own, left to her own devices. Through the heroic efforts of first responders, many lives were saved, including a number of frightened and injured animals. We had to really think about how could we create a bandage that would provide protection, pain relief, and also help with healing. We had heard that they were trying tilapia down in Brazil for people, and I thought, well, could we do something similar for animals? It's exciting to know that an animal that would normally have likely perished was now being released and out into habitat that was going to be really suitable for it. She did turn back once to say goodbye. She was like, you know, I'm feeling better and I'm ready to go back to my home. That's looking better. That's why we love what we do, because they have such a spirit to survive. And that's something that inspires all of us.